tonight at 10 on WCCO. You know, Mike and I take turns each week bringing you Finding Minnesota reports. Yeah, we've had a lot of fun stories over the years, but today I'm bringing you the worst. It involves the community of Mattawa, which is so small it doesn't even have a post office. But with the worst day quickly approaching, people there are getting pretty excited. Let me show you why as we go Finding Minnesota. When you meet Tom Bislow at his mustard-colored store, get ready for the worst jokes. Oh, you've never sausage a place. He has the worst decorations, the worst weather station. And for big events, he drives the worst bus. We can do anything with worst, but we're the best. <laughs> His business, TJ's Country Corner, sells more than 30,000 pounds of worst each year, sausages, brats, and jerky. Now he's getting ready for the brat trot and teeny weeny run as part of Worst Day. Just a fun day. We have the worst band. It's a three-piece band that plays polka music. Worst Day also attracts some of the best eaters. Local farmer Mike Salzer is the reigning champ of sausage eating in Mattawa. He's competed three times, and he's not been beaten yet. You ready for this? You're going down. I've eaten eight and three quarters buns and sausages in five minutes. Some of his challenges are easier than others. All right, let's do it. His technique is unconventional. I'm only halfway done with my first one, and you're done with three. Trophies of his don't lie. I just have a lot of volume. <laughs> Hi, Amber. Worst day is Tom Bislow's effort to get some attention for this little community. The town site itself is maybe 50 people. TJ's is the only store in town. But Bislow draws hundreds of people to several different events and keeps them coming back for more. So we bring people to town to try our sausage, and they like it, and they buy it. Is it over? <laughs> it's over. I just want to let you know, in the time it took me to eat just one hot dog, the, the champ there ate five big sausages. And it looked like it was, he, he was soaking the bun. He was getting it wet. With water. Yeah, he's down, so he wouldn't have dry mouth, so it could work faster. He was also breaking up the, uh, the sausages here. That, that's his technique. And apparently it's allowed uh, there in the rules. But, uh, yeah, he's going to be going for his fourth straight title uh, this Saturday in Mattawa. If you'd like to check out the Worst website, we have a link to it at WCCO.com slash links. Good lunchtime fare there, wouldn't you say? <laughs> You're proud of yourself. I'll have a salad. I think I, I'll have a salad. I, I tried, at least. Well, yeah, you did. You put in a good effort. Yeah. Um, well, coming up uh, next couple of days, I think we have some good grilling weather. Whether you're ah, grilling for perfect. many sausages for one or <laughs> several sausages for many, it doesn't matter. It's going to be good.